I guess I can make my microphone live. Uh, hi all familiar faces and new faces too. I, I see a bunch of new people in here too. Uh, and Mega Dragonite, really? <laughs> Mega Dragonite. <laughs> oh no! Oh, you're gonna you're gonna role play again? I I, I mean, uh, I'm not gonna stop you, but y you could like use Discord or something for that. I I'm gonna I'm gonna say right out of the gate, hi Kenneth. Um, I'm not feeling that well today, so I'm maybe not gonna go as long as I usually do. But who knows? Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling a little under the weather, and I'm doing the best thing for my health and playing video games. <laughs> Doc, Doctor, Doctor Gold Crow, PhD here, knows how to treat the symptoms. And so I grinded and grinded. Grinded till my heart's content, and I got everything. <laughs> you gonna sit back and watch me or them? <laughs> Unstoppable. And yes, I leveled everything up, actually. Uh, not s some of the better stuff in the box, like, like that. I got to level 31. All, uh, yeah, I got this to 25. I got everything here to 25. And then everything here to 31. Except these two, my... Yeah, yeah, you can do both. Yeah, I know. I just got, I got a migraine and... Ugh. Not feeling well. Let's hope the cheeseburger is done. Why don't we have, uh... I don't know, hot dogs. A chili cheese dog. <laughs> we'll be starting in about five minutes. Just let everyone come in, file in. I maybe have uh, our buddy Pyrols on a little later. Uh, he said he'd join later, so I'll just like get him in in here and talk to him. He was the guy who was on while we were talking about game theories. <laughs> As we made game theories. Yeah, it should get better. I'll probably be better by tomorrow or Sunday. That's the worst, because it's the weekend right now. <laughs> you want you want to be all healthy for the, the weekend. You're in... I just noticed you have a Harambe avatar suck King Krusty Lemon. Very respectable. Very 10 out of 10 avatar. We'll never forget Harambe. I've been playing this totally sweet game recently. You play as some little dude who runs around and whacks enemies to the beat of the music. Wait, what's he... Is he referencing, uh... Mother? Yeah, he's referencing Mother 3, I think. That's sort of... Except I wouldn't describe Lucas as cool. Yeah, well, that could be a Mother 3 reference there. They're very rare, but here in the Kalos re region, you can't find mysterious stones that are filled with life energy. A shining stone that emitted a great warmth was discovered, and then a great tower was built to house and protect the stone. Oh, is that the mega stone house over there? Okay. Love Ness? Well, he has that super powerful back throw. Does Mother take place in the Pokemon world? <laughs> yeah, maybe. This game is like, what? It came out in 2013, I believe. So it's like three years old. Or four years old, I guess. Yeah. 
I'm gonna start up in two minutes. <laughs> I feel the exact same way, Kawhi Blue Neko. <laughs> no offense or anything to your brother. Oh, well, we can't read the books? Let's sit down. I want to sit down here. No, I can't. Okay, oh, yeah, I can. Look to the side. Look to the side. Look to the side. What? 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 I'm just shaking my head. No. No! Could change our clothes, too. I'd rather the the default outfit. You actually can't take off the hat. We already played Sun and Moon. You weren't here for that. I think you joined while we were playing X and Y. Alright, I think we should start. So I'm all ready for this, this gym battle. Uh, outlet now has acrobatics which is like a super powerful flying move and it has it has a plus an attack so acrobatics is gonna serve us well it's gonna have double power hey moo moo studios what's happening i remember you from last time you're one of the the newer people some of these people were around since i've been uh streaming when i was streaming the phoenix Wright game some new people hopped on, more so with this game than with uh, Sun and Moon. Uh, okay, I think we're ready. Oh, uh, no, I, like I said, I've been sick these past few days. I'm, like, just kind of getting over it. So, I'm, I'll, I'll be better. But, yeah, yes, Cheeseburger is a chat odd. He is in our, our PC right now. Let that be the only reference to cheeseburgers to grace this chat. Now we are ready to face Karina, too. Sick grind, man! Her name is Lady Karina? What are you, like a, a knight or something? You noble? Okay, I don't know what she has in front, but Amolga should serve us well. Has the same typing as Zapdos, actually. So now the weird gym theme again. Wow, she's like doing a high jump kick. Yeah, we're taking the Lucario, don't worry. Uh, in Nuzlocke, I consider the gift Pokemon fair game. So, we should, oh, we should sweep her team. If I don't get fake out, fake outed. Just acrobatics. We're just going to acrobatics all the day, every day. Yeah, yeah, I guess we'll do a Phoenix Wright 7 when it inevitably comes out. Now, he could just kind of screw me over and have, like, some sort of rock move, but I doubt that's gonna happen. No, we're just gonna sweep her team with an Amolga. <laughs> yeah, that's what it seems like, Unstoppable. Now, this is the thing I was dreading. Uh, you are weak to acrobatics, so I guess we're just gonna use it. You're gonna hone claws? Let's hope I one-shot it, because I don't... She's gonna use Hyper Potion. No, uh, why? Well, I resist both its stabs, so... Yeah, there's the Hyper Potion. Well, at least we get a free hit. We might get a critical! No, we did not get a critical. Ah, uh, too bad we didn't have, like, Quick Attack or something. Just, yeah, Mulga's just broken. <laughs> oh, you're just gonna... No, you're just gonna keep doing that, huh? 
And then Amulga dies. Yeah, I'm kind of bracing myself for that after the disaster that was last part. Whoa, I got a low damage roll. I didn't even bring it to red. Uh... Oh, man. Acrobatics. Oh, okay. I win. Pokemon Glaze. That's a fan game, I take it. No, I do not have an item on Outlet, Unstoppable. I know the mechanics of acrobatics. And look, th that was easy, huh? <laughs> That's the power of Amolga. This has to be like the weirdest set of badges ever. Just the the shapes of them are just look very odd. Oh, we can use Surf now, but we need the HM. Oh, and that might serve us well too, Power Up Punch. I think the Lucario up there has... Okay, but... Okay, the thing is... We have to use the Lucario to beat her Lucario. So if I die, we can't use Lucario, right? And it, it's pretty random because they're strong against each other. What's my team? It is uh, Outlet, Bubba, Glutton, Mike, King, and Duty Lump. <laughs> yeah, Pokemon died for our sins. I don't think the odds were in Amolga's favor there. I mean, we're against Amolga. Because, uh, it double resists, well, it resists both sides of Halucha and just acrobatics all the way. Okay, anyway, let's go get our Lucario, maybe. As we do the sick grind. You know, I, I, right, Claw, I just read your message because I'm, like, so out of it. It looked like you said, I f I'm thankfully my brother is dead. Like, wait, what? Just reading between the lines there. Okay, let's heal up. I think you can get a few items inside the Tower of, uh, I forget what it's called, the Tower of Mega Evolution. Evolution. I said that weird. Hey, a fun fact, this is my favorite bike theme in any Pokemon game. I'm on a bike, I'm on a bike, and I'm riding to this giant tower. Be okay, we're off the bike now. Okay, Father Megastone, give me... Okay, she's at the top of the tower. Yes, Ryu from Street Fighter. I have, I beat Karina. Now I know someone in here gives you some items. A TM, in fact. Lucario is the world's first mega evolution. Wow. Evil, I keep saying Eevee illusion. <laughs> it's evolution. Well, this Lucario... It looks short. I have, like, oh, I guess they are supposed to be that big. Mega Evolution. Wait, what? Check it. The Mega Evolution Guru is apparently a descend. Oh, he's a descendant. I thought he was the first one to Mega Evolve a Pokemon. Oh, we, we sweep Karina with uh, Molga Sonic Link. <laughs> That's what we did. Just destroyed her. I think you're the one? Yeah, low sweep. <laughs> Since we've only been going like seven minutes, <laughs> you, you probably know how that went. Or how fast we did it, or how we utterly destroyed her. Uh, low sweep. No one can learn that. But power up punch... This may fare useful. Yeah, I've read some of his work too. I, I like some of his fanfics. Uh, Shadow Claw. Let's get rid of that. We don't need that. Because Ghost is only strong against 
Ghost. And that's it. Hi, Gamer Muhammad. What's happening? I, I, you finally made the stream. You're just in time to watch us destroy Karina for the second time. I have a feeling just because I said that, I'm not going to do it. I really love this place. When I'm here with my Pokemon, looking at the wide open sky above, all my worries disappear. And I feel like I could do anything. This is the random parts where I just randomly speak out the narrations. Thanks for coming all this all the way up here. It was decided that this must be the place where the Mega Ring is handed over. Only well, did Calum have to go through this too when you give it to him post game? Something about something about making sure we never forget to set our sights as high as the sky. And here it is, your very own Mega Ring. It's in the shape of a bracelet, so it's super easy to wear. Doop -ba -doop -ba 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 -ba. No, we don't get to hear that. Give your Pokemon the right Mega Stone and try battling with it. Your Pokemon will surely answer the call of the Mega Ring. Your Digivice, I mean Mega Ring. Hmm, Lucario, what's wrong? I love you. Lucario, are you sure? You want to battle alongside that trainer? I, I thought you were supposed to be able to talk. I guess you just have to be in a movie, though. I don't know what to say. To but I'm a bit shocked that some tra traveling trainer seems to have a stronger bond with you than I do. Haha. <laughs> well, she must be something special. <laughs> Don't be embarrassed that you have an audience. You should be proud. Just embrace it. A Lucario on Lucario. Uh. I read that first sentence really, really wrong, or bad, bad, uh, bad thoughts are coming up. There'll be nothing short of, I've never seen that r word, ri, ri, riv oh, riveting, riveting. They both have Lucario Knight in hand. How about we get the show on the road? Yes. Okay. So if we lose, then we don't get to keep Lucario, I'll, I'll keep that rule in place. And it's pretty easy to lose here, actually. Get on the zero! Oh, she's super serious now, not doing her high jump kick. She's a little embarrassed she hit the wall. She crashed. It sort of looks like the the things in Tales of Symphonia. The what are they? What? I forget what they called. I've, it's been a while since I played Tales. Okay, um, so we have two, see, it's really weird here, because it's all going to depend on who's faster. We're naturally going to Mega Evolve. And we could use Bone, but we'd rather get Stab, right? Yeah. Mega Shinka! Digimon, digital monster. It's weird hair things. There's aura detectors. Oh, she has a mega glove. Yeah, x fears I I won't. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm not. I'm not revealing what's in that. But she could get a critical hit. That's what I'm afraid of. And she's probably gonna get that critical hit. Okay. Oh, okay, so as long as there's not a speed tie, we win. Yeah, okay. Good, we win. Awesome. I am the successor now. <laughs> that was an explosive battle. It was like two turns. Grrrr! 
Like, I used to think those things on Lucario's head were its ears, but no, its ears are on it, on top of its head. Just kind of, kind of, I see it as a dog, so, you know, I, I'd expect to have, like, droopy ears. But yes. Okay. Fang? Uh, we'll, we'll see what the chat wants. We'll see what everyone... Who wants... What, what's the name of this Lucario? I'll take the first one that stands out to me. Furry. Oh, right. I think we agreed on that, Sonic Link. It's going to be named the Lucario I found in the Black and White 2 randomizer. Yeah, go play Tales of Symphonia. It's a good game. Except Furry was a girl. This one's male. No, it's not a joke. I... I keep trying to put together a video for voice actors for it, but it's just kind of hard to describe what I want. I'll try to get it by Sunday. I'm making no promises. I was supposed to get it up yesterday. But now I have to do the stream today, and then it's it's me time tomorrow. And we're going to get a Lapras, too. Oh, it already... I was gonna... Oh, wait, I could go teach it power-up punch, but I already have that. That's okay, Creeper. Yeah, they're... I know a lot of people who like the Tales of games. Steven? It's like, and Steven! It's gonna be Lapras. That's our next Pokemon. We're getting it. No ifs, ands, or buts. Because I don't think... Well, there is a way we can surf across, but I just have to evolve that Azuril. That we uh, found at the beginning of the game. I did train it up. It never evolved, though. I had a Soothe Bell on it, too. I think we have to free up a spot, too. Um, hmm. You know, Amolga, you served me well. I think we're going to go with the Lapras, though. Uh, it's a secret what the partner is in Explorers. <laughs> you really want to roleplay, don't you? Oh, now what? Oh, it's Calum. Oh, that, that was... It, 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 wait, wait, wait! Here, take this. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Um... Yeah, where's my, uh... Where's my man? Right there. Yay, we got a... I, to be honest, I've only played Symphonia and uh, the the other Symphonia game. What's this Lapras' name? It's a male Lapras. What's its name? Lapras is actually pretty good. Actually, I, you know, I like the name Zestiria, so. <laughs> it's just a really cool sounding name. So, Zestiria, <laughs> there we go. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, we'd have hot dog and cheeseburger. Uh, and <laughs> Nitto King can learn surf. We'll get rid of oh oh yeah Parish Song. That 
That could actually be useful if, uh... <laughs> you could just spam potions and kill two things. Uh... Oh, maybe we should have kept it, Molga. Oh, we can Mega Shinka now, Mike. Oh, a Japanese buffet? Yummy. I'm thinking... You know what? I'm gonna go get a Molga. If we're going on water, then maybe we should keep a Molga with us. Boop, 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 boop. Well, what you do with it is you use pair swung, pair swung, pair song, and then just switch out. Um, let's get rid of you, and you know I've I've grown a little attached to a Molga. We can't just exploit a Molga and throw it right back in the box. You're the you're the replacement Mimikyu. We don't even need to put an item on it because of the acrobatics, acrobatics, acrobatics. Uh, I was thinking of doing Final Fantasy IX uh, after I'm done this because that's my favorite Final Fantasy game. And I, I think it's interesting enough to play it for a stream. It's the only Final Fantasy game that, like, doesn't piss me off. <laughs> to be honest. Well, yeah, yeah, because they put a spotlight in all the characters. It isn't just Zidane. They do it on everyone, and I, that's what I kind of like about it, because there's so many different character arcs going on at the same time. It was the last great Final Fantasy game, in my opinion. Oh, wow, Amolga, you didn't one-shot this thing? Yeah, Fefe could have been our water steed, but... We have to settle with the gift Lapras. <laughs> Wait, is that an item there? No, it's just the crystal water. I notice you too, Nicholas. It's just there's so many people now and they're talking so fast. Yes, that is that is not opinion there, Sonic Link. That is a fact. It is not subjective at all. Objective fact there. Uh, yeah, potentially. I, I do think... I, I don't know if we'll play it normally or we'll Nuzlocke. I don't know. But yeah. Fun fact, I live in the same city as Proton John. I got pedal dance. 120. That could actually be very potent. Potent. Um, we don't need growth. Localization. Burtman. Now's the time we pull out, Bubba. So this pedal dance won't be as good in, uh... In this version of Nuzlocke. Because... Uh, we can't switch out after. But let's pedal dance! I'm just gonna eat up that clamp, thank you very much. I know, it's... I, I don't know why people would hate it. Maybe they got used to 7 and 8's very sci-fi. Because 7 and 8 are more like final sci-fi than Final Fantasy. 
Uh, Final Fantasy IX just kind of took it back to its roots. And this is where we can get the Whip Dream, too. Oh, okay. A Linoon? Why are you packing that garbage, Mr. Backpacker Man? Actually, we do have a Zigzagoon, so I shouldn't be talking. That's why we use acrobatics. I've heard the... Uh, I'll try not to miss it. I, I usually do the streams on either Sunday, Wednesday, Friday. And sometimes Monday. Well, no one could fault you for that, Bright Cly. I mean, we live in kind of a, a very cinematic age of video games where, you know, they have to take the story seriously in some some cases. And we can actually get the Whip Dream here, too. See, I knew there would be a hidden item there. No dowsing machine needed. Some no-scope MLG Pro there. Um, yeah, this isn't a new route, so... I think it's somewhere up here. Hop on my steed. Go! You know, this was advertised in the trailers, and you hardly do it. Uh, it's somewhere around here. You could actually skip all the trainers if you ride the go-go, or, yeah, the, or, skiddo out there. Oh! Oh, well, you know what we could do with this? Some evolution time. Bottom, bottom! Uh, well, if you like fantasies, then Final Fantasy IX is for you. Do a face reveal. Well, I, I sort of did a face reveal if you know where to look. Um... Let's go over here. It's like behind the house or something. Uh, I think, yeah, I could, I could totally see it. It's behind the house. But how do you get behind the house? Do you go through the back door? Hmm. Okay, attract. Very situational. Well, unless we know what we're going against, then attract could be useful. How do you get to the back of the house? Like, I think there's a... Hmm. Yeah, I kind of liked how you uh, leveled up through... Through items, rather than... Then, uh, you just learn stuff. You can actually avoid all the trainer battles if you do it like this. I'm just trying to figure out how we get the Whip Dream. Oh, I think I found it. Yep, there it is. Awesome. Final Fantasy IX kind of had a random final boss, but... Oh, oh. Okay, who has a Pokemon X version? <laughs> I need to trade. Or we can save it for later. 
We'll save it for later. It's not on my party right now. But we have it in our pocket if we need it. Okay. Perfect. Now... Uh, no, we're, we're gonna get an encounter. I think there's full baby in here. Oh, Pachirisu! Take some Draco meteors lately? Oh, and I got your clone here. Who's a clone of another clone, or another two clones. Or a clone of a clone who's a clone of a electric rat. Oh, I hate HMs. I'll get that later if I... Don't worry, guys. I'm not going to do it now. I should really switch out Amolga. <laughs> yeah, you're probably going to have to update the game. Ow. And yeah, I get the poison. Of course I get the poison. I think Final Fantasy IX is like one of the better looking games on the PlayStation 1. Like as in Final Fantasy VII looks like total garbage by today's standards. Oh, we gotta switch out. From the West Mill Tank. And we're gonna send out. Oh, let's, let's, let's use our furry. And of course it gets a critical hit. Favorite Pokemon? Yeah, let's ask the chat now. What's everyone's favorite Pokemon? I think we get this question very often, but, you know, it's good to... Oh, okay, I'll check Discord. Yeah. Okay, um... There, Pyrels is gonna join us. Hi. Say hello I'm to in, baby. Hi to the chat. Uh, we're just like everyone's discussing their favorite Pokemon right now. Again, that that question oh. again. That question oh. seems to well, pop up. Best question. Yeah. yeah. There's always like new people here. There's 19 people here, so yeah. I guess we got new people and lurkers alike. Yeah, but the lurkers are the best people. But it's time for some, uh, uh, Mega Shinka! There we go. There we go. Punch that Miltic. Oh, I'm not even gonna KO it. Aw, oh, you guys are nice. So, so we're back on that, on that type of con, the old favorite Pokemon. That's, yeah. That's a good one. Yeah. Yep. Uh,. What were you about to say? Oh, okay. What? Uh, what I was saying, my favorite Pokemon oh. will always be, uh, and the entire line of Snivy. I took one look at it as a kid, and I'm like, this is my favorite Pokemon. And the only, the only other, um, Pokemon I felt that way towards was Poplio after I saw that Pre-Marina was a thing. Oh, do you even like Superior too? I'm a big fan. I have plushies of all three. Oh. Like, not many people yeah. like the final evolutions of uh, the Unova trio. Really? Uh, I mean, like, maybe because, like, Snivy loses his arms. That <laughs> might be why, like, people are like, uh. No, I don't. I don't know. Well, the superior to me just carries this like regality to it, and I, I, I love the design. Like, I love the flare du lis that like just goes down its middle. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't notice that. Yeah, yeah. It's like an upside. It's like a flare du lis. So I'm like, oh, this is like some. And like the whole, 
its head kind of looks like it's blooming or like growing from like this sort of large collar, you know? I sort of saw it as like a banana. <laughs> or a banana. It's the best, it's the best, uh, banana. Oh god, no, the game theory's coming back. <laughs> oh no, this is what you bring. What I bring. Do you see what happened last time? They were just role-playing. They, they were doing it while we, like, went off-air, too. They just kept Wait, going. What? Yeah, they were role-playing. Role-play, using my stream to role-play. Uh, they role-playing as? Uh, I think they were role-playing some sort of... Pokemon thing. Mega Dragonite apparently appeared, and Arceus sent Darkrai to the Shadow Realm or something. And yes, I notice was you, like, Savitar. Or was it like kind of like dicking around? I think a bit of both. I don't know. You're gonna have to ask them. Some were taking more taking it more seriously than others. I'm not against. I'm not against uh, role playing. I actually spend a fair amount of time on uh, whenever I'm playing WoW. There's actually an event currently going on for the entire week. It's a server-wide event, um, where it's just this huge like tournament or whatever, and uh, I'm competing in the Hearthstone tournament. So that's why I'm gonna dip for thirty uh, at around nine o'clock my time, which oh. is thirty minutes. I'm gonna dip and and I have to I have to play for third. If I get third, I get 25,000 gold in-game, but I also get a customly done Hearthstone card. Oh, cool. I know some people who play Hearthstone. It's quite popular it's... for me. Yeah, the only problem is that I had RNG abandon me last night. Hmm. Hi, Cosmic Owl. Sorry, I'm, like, saying hi to, like, all these new people. It's been, like, crazy lately. You gotta do. Hmm. I understand. And why I'm playing as a girl? Because why not? Would you rather look at a guy all day long or a girl? We bring weird to the stream. Yes, we do, Sonic Link. Yes, we do. We bring weird to the stream. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mega uh, Shinka! After my um, uh, match, I'll probably be back. So. All right. Uh, we're only going to be going for two hours. I use So an hour and a half more. Uh, I'll be, I'll be, I'll, I'll be around at least for the last probably thirty minutes or something. It depends on how fast these matches go, and if I come back salty, I'll try not to come back salty. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, but come back sal salty by all means. People love salt. All right, I'll pour it on. Well, if, if you don't do well, come salty, but come victorious yeah. if uh, you. Hopefully, I'll come victorious, mm. and then the other, the person who got fourth will be very salty because they get jack. I'm like, whew. And we went and to keep in mind this tournament's been going on for all week. It's been, you know, yeah, it's, it's been going freaking all week. So it's just been a constant struggle. Like I'd wake up, go to work, come home, and then I'd like freak out until the time came along. I would like overanalyze everything. I don't know. <laughs> uh, but yeah. What would happen if Sonic Link says, so what would happen if we have both me and Pyros in the stream? Would the world end? I would, yeah. No, that's just... No, you'd have people role-playing game theories, then. Playing... <laughs> Someone it's the role-play as MatPat. Yeah. The it's the role-play as Gaijin Goomba. Like, that's yeah. how it works. Yeah. <laughs> just... Because I had him on last time, and that's what happened. Oh, okay. Game theory. I do read the comments. Uh, don't you hear me? I, I, I'm reading it right now. It's a loaded question because now because I'm answering the question you just gave me. Uh, yeah, you're Steel Lucario, so beat up this Zangoose. Why Lucario is Steel at all? Just because he has a spike in his chest and just two okay, hands. Okay, yeah, that just makes him steel type. <laughs> sure. Alright. Fair enough. I, I don't like how kind of broken Mega Evolution is in this game. Like, uh... Like, so when like you're... actually fixed in uh, later editions? Yeah. When you're just playing through the actual story. 
Omega Evolution thing. I mean, I remember seeing it. I was like, oh, cool. And I actually got a, I got an Absol and trained one and Eevee trained it specifically just because I loved its Mega Evolution form. Then I realized that Absol kind of sucks. <laughs> um, like, I tried to have him, I think, as like a sweeper or something. I don't know. I never went into competitive Pokemon that much. But I don't know. It's not that I hate Mega Evolution. I just feel like it's a little, I don't know just kind of feels like yeah it's like a game breaker you're right duty lump is a duosion you you troll bob Evolution in x and y is broken can I, about, I, I, can I talk about how much i love uh skidoo and go goat i think they're the cutest freaking little little buggers yeah i was just riding them yeah yeah i know uh, that's why i was like mentioning it but uh it's, like skidoo is just so cute i'm like ah oh, a grass goat Combining two of my favorite things, grass types and goats. I didn't like how they showed it in the trailer, and it's only, like, one little section of the They're game. Only, yeah, I know. They're... I was like, what was that? I mean, like, maybe if that was, like, a whole thing, you know, you would ride a skidoo in a battle, sure, but I don't know, man. And it shows, like, in some concept art, it shows him riding it in Lumo City, but you'd never do that. Yeah. I don't, think, I don't think they would want you to ride a goat into that city. <laughs> you see you them. Know, you know how those Frenchies are. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, get your goat out of here. Oh. oh. <laughs> Just... <laughs> Still beyond, like, twirls. Like, the little, like, you know, like, one of the ribbons is, like, acts as a mustache. If you're, like, a... Uh, you get, like, a little ribbon that acts as, like, a handlebar. You get to twirl that around. Like, oh. <laughs> Oh, uh, I'm gonna battle this yeah. man in front of the gym. Uh, I'm done with work, so I can actually do stuff again. Oh, there's my last day of teaching kids, and that was—I'm gonna I'm be real. That was soul crushing. Like the entire experience was pretty soul crushing. Crushing, as <laughs> in like it was hard, or oh, I don't want to leave these kids. That way for some. But not for this group. That's Trick Room. And you're a little behind me if you're watching the stream because of the delay. I'm going to be a little bit on the behind side. So you're going to react to something and then I'm going to be like five seconds later. Yeah. Oh! That, that girl I just talked to gives you a new TM every day, I think. I think she gives acrobatics, actually, which is really good. Oh, it's Miss Champion Lady. And Sycamore and his really French music. Yeah, see, now I'm at the point where you got Trick Room. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Crow, will you bring voice actors from Super Mystery Dungeon Dub on your next stream? Uh, maybe. It depends. Uh, you see, the way we recorded, it wasn't like really I got them all into a room and we're gonna do some cold reads. I just... We did it over email and Skype, honestly. Like, they just sent me the files. I'm like, oh, I need this redone. Kind of, you... yeah. kind of like a drop-in, drop-out sort of situation. Yeah. Oh, hi, champion lady. That is really boring and not, like, interesting in the absolute slightest. <laughs> yep. Like, her only interesting moment is when she's talking to Lizandre and he's being, like, super unsubtle. Oh, and did you see what we caught last episode, Pyrals? I'll show you in a second once we get to the Pokemon yeah. Center. Yeah, hey, here's some some One, like I think Mohammed, huh? Deep character, right here. I I have I have a sneaking suspicion. I already know what it's going to be. Yeah, we'll it's cheeseburger. Ah. Um, yeah, it's the monorail. So this is a little stupid because the Pokemon Center is up here in this this gondola-like thing. Or no, it's a car, a train car. But it takes you up somehow. It's super unnecessary. Uh, oh, there it is right here. This is philosophical BS about <laughs> bonds and characters. Shut up! Try to be Fire Emblem here. Our bonds give us strength! <laughs> and somehow I can prevent you from getting hits constantly. There it is. There's Cheeseburger. 
once you catch up. I need to wait for the stream to catch up. Yeah. And then I'll... yeah. Okay, going to the Pokemon Center. A uh, question: What's your favorite Pokemon gen? Says Muhammad. Five, black and white. Hey. Well, well, it's about time you had me on your team. Now put me in, coach. <laughs> no, put no. Me in. Do it. I dare you, motherfucker. I, I think I was like, no, oh, my nemesis. <laughs> <laughs> when we ran into him. <laughs> Let me review your sensory <laughs> duty report. Well, 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 your results were. <laughs> that was my personal favorite flub I've ever had. Cause I just I'm, now I imagine Chad just being like he like looks at it, he's like shit. How many Pokemon? Got a perfect score. Just gonna make us uh, look at footprints and uh, uh, contest armor. We've lost Pepe the Frogadier, lost Mimikyu the Pikachu, and we lost you the S the Meow Stick. This is already rough, man. Yeah, we lost very Pepe like. <laughs> That's when this, 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 this is when you jump the shark, okay? This is when you, like, sold out to the man, okay? When you lost Pepe. I didn't know you could find wild lappers here. Go on. I like Lapras. Yeah, it's kind of like an iconic design. And we found an obvious hidden... You know, you have that sixth sense for, like, hidden items. It's like, oh, there's a rock in the middle of nowhere. I wonder if there's an item on it. Don't even need the dowsing machine. I think there's a like a sea route up here. I can catch something new. Where do you want to come from? Oh, I shouldn't have duty lump in the front. Maybe it's really slow and I can't it says get lump. one. Yeah, that's duty lump, dude. It's his duty. Oh. <laughs> Well, have a Psy Shock Tentacruel. Please don't use the chat out. <laughs> An excuse to keep, like, talking smack yeah. throughout the entire time of being used. Well, the next gym is grass. We could use it. Or it could just be cheap asses and use the, the Mega Charizard. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, I guess Bubba should be in the front. Yeah, Azure right Bay. You need, you need to use the John. Okay. Oh, we get Tentacruel again. Remember Tentacruel? For, or Tentacruel? ShamWow? ShamWow from uh, Sun and Moon? That, like, won us the... The, the whole... St <laughs> Elite Four. And click. Don't use the chat out. Wow, you guys are very adamant. Okay, I don't want to just name this one ShamWow again. What's Tentacool's name? You want to eat that chat out's name. You know what? We're gonna bring Chad out into the next gym. I don't care. I don't care. I'm tired of this. Ah, oh, there we go. All right, we're just naming a tentacool right now. I don't know how we're what we're gonna name it. I usually just let the chat do it. Tentaculo, zap, a cool tent, Kali. What is Tentaculo a reference to? Tentaculo, okay. Tie. What was that? You kind of cut out there? Should name him Hentai. <laughs> I, I, I think I did that in my uh, black and white too. Do well then. Everyone wants Tentaculo, and we're going to use Chad out for the gym. It's settled. Gosh. Oh. 
Maybe we'll be lucky and he'll die. Should have burnt a, a repel there. Well, first we have to kick Caleb's ass. You know, that tentac... It might actually be good because... Oh, hi, Jarell. You know, how how were you lurking before, or did you just stumble on this on the related section or something? I I think Pyrel's died. Oh, I'm here. Oh, you're here. Okay. Thinking, doing that the the old thinking emoji, you know. Huh. I don't know why that became a meme, but apparently it did. The next gym is the grass gym. Amazing. The guy's actually pretty easy, so maybe Chatta will chatter his way to victory. Or Cheeseburger, sorry. Okay, we don't need... Uh... Well, actually, all my Pokemon are pretty good. We'll, we'll get rid of Duty Lump for now. And... Okay, I know Kalem has Meow Stick first. Okay, so we're just gonna sweep his whole goddamn team with Megazard. <laughs> I sweep that shit. Sweep him right under that rug. I think the gym is right here. Yeah. Sorry to keep you waiting. Do 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 do. It's a good game. Well, a great game. Yeah, I love that game. Like I, I just wish they would make another. Well, how long has it been? Uh, just wait 25 more years and maybe? That came, out, that came out 2010, yeah? Yeah, so only 15 years. Ten. Yep. Or no, uh... Seven years. Yeah. To that train, because I bought a my first 3DS, which I still have, is um just a regular refurbished one. It's one of the purple ones. Yeah. Um, Mega Shinka! Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is amazing. I, I remember the hand cramps though. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I I could I could deal with that because because how good it was. It was it was worth the pain. It was one of those games that was completely worth the pain. Hmm. The writing is so good in it. God. Straight up. That's just what they call the rival. God of speed. And our furry is leveling up. Oh, I if I feel about that, if I'm correct, uh, Absol is becomes the rival's mega once uh, you beat the game. Yeah, and it's called Serena if you you play a male character. Like, why do I feel like that's just he's just trying to be overtly edgy? He's trying to be another silver. <laughs> yeah, here's my cool Absol. I'm just imagining that. You, you, do, have you seen that? Um, okay, you, you know that new Sonic game coming out, right? Sonic for Affinity Forces. Yeah, <laughs> for Affinity Forces. Yeah. Um, there's that new villain or whatever, voiced by Liam O'Brien, and he's like super edgy, infinite. No, uh, and he's like he's faster than Sonic. I mean, like literally, he's a freaking he's a meme in and of yeah. itself. He's an but original like, I imagine, character. Now I imagine your rival like. Playing his music whenever uh, his Absol comes out and Mega evolves, because <laughs> he has that like Lincoln Park sounding theme to it. Oh yeah, I've heard like, that. Oh, these... <laughs> these knew what they were doing. They absolutely knew what the heck they were doing. It was it's hilarious. If if they're really being like ironic with that, then that's just hilarious. And there's no way they're that dumb to think that they're not being. They can't be ironic with it. God. Okay, we kicked Kalem's ass. Now it's time for oh. Chadot versus I I forget the guy's name. He's just like this old my, man my, with head. Keep in mind that my reactions are going to be incredibly late. So here yeah. We go. If I if I could screen share on 
on Discord, I would. But... Yeah, that'd be nice, but it's all right. Huh. Do I have any idea? Oh, okay, Armando, Armando, this was a better one. Is Patrick Star a mutated star you? <laughs> Maybe. Or I don't know. He doesn't have the gem on him. Also a communist. Nah, uh, guys, the game theories and the role play. And game theories about cheeseburgers today, yes. I think they did. The gym design looks very samey for every single one. It's just like ascending just to show off. Oh, it's 3D Pokemon. Isn't it cool? In 3D! <laughs> this was the. The first main series Pokemon game, if you don't want to include Colosseum and XD, which is a stu such a stupid name for uh, <laughs> XD. Because <laughs> Serena's wifey. Wifey, sorry, I'm guessing he forgot the ooh. <laughs> Oh no, now we're having Pokemon shipping wars here. Well, okay, this chat out has Chatter, Sing, Mirror Move, and Taunt. Hmm. Oh, let's try Chatter. I, I've never oh, used... Green. I've never used yeah, Chatter. Just... <laughs> just had a critical hit come its way. Uh, if I fucking die, I swear to God. It, it confused with Chatter. It has three HP left because of that critical hit, so we better... I forgot to go to the Pokemon Center, too. Well, it's about damn time. We can put this l later. Oh, you meant God. this. <laughs> that is so much damage. Holy crap. <laughs> and he's resistant, too. <laughs> There, that's my chat on. If you, if you know what's good for you, get me the hell out of here. Literally just pulled a Brian Cave with that. He pulled a, like, a not as impressive Brian Cave. <laughs> to, the, in, to the shipping wars when it came to Pokemans. Oh, is that... Um, is that what the stream is going to be about now? Is it going to be about shipping? I guess. I think we're going to roll with it. This is now a shipping stream. I mean, it's like it's not that I'm against shipping things. I ship things. Oh, I got a message, I think. Yeah, you have to go pretty soon, huh? Yep. All right. Wish me luck, stream. I'm about to go meet my maker. So All right. I'm just going to deafen myself. I'll be back. Uh... When I say hi, I'm back. All right, and uh, you'll see if Chad out made it or not. They won't though, knowing knowing <laughs> our luck. <laughs> Critical seed bomb. Ash ketchup. What's your friend code? Um, I don't know right now. This is my capture 3ds, so uh, I'd have to look for the 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 code on it. I think a lot of people really like the Serena stuff because they did a good job with it because she knew Ash prior and stuff. But then they just switch up the girls every every season of Pokemon. That sick guitar sting! Bye you! We're getting all the stuff that Chatot cannot beat. Stupid steel typing. Guess Mike has to be a janitor here. Clean up all these. <laughs> Got him to 3 HP. Eat a flame burst. You know, we're not even going to Mega Shinka because this doesn't call for a Mega Shinka.
Misty's never gonna show up again. Lombre, huh? Oh, well, that's annoying. You're you're picking all the the types that I don't have a counter to. Well, she kissed Ash, I, I think. I think they appeared they appeared in a an ending somewhere recently. Yep, yeah, that's exactly it, Sonic Link. Nail on the head. Perry and Annabeth, who is that? Oh. Oh, cool, we got Ice Beam. That's like a really good move. Generation 1, anyway. Wait, that was a Pokemon Ranger. Do they have the weird little stupid Styler thing from the Ranger games? Here's my Pokemon Spinner. I actually think this is the right way, but I want to... I want to level up Cheeseburger. Oh, this is just a dead end. I've heard of Perry Jackson. Jackson? Jackson? I just haven't... Uh, read it or watched it because I know there's a movie adaption too uh, did you found it weird that you didn't show up in four streams uh you showed up for one while we were doing Sun and Moon but yeah you're you're probably busy right hi pocket sketch there's another regular Okay, finally, we have something that Cheeseburger could take on. Use Chatter! You just have to do half. Oh, I think it's confusion 100%. Don't worry, we're not going to switch out, so that's all good. There's an article on Pokemon Shipping Wars that are written in the World War II article. Oh, we're... Okay, you better one-shot this, Cheeseburger. You're quad effective. Okay, this is actually kind of cool. 100% confusion? It's just gonna kill itself! Cheeseburger rocks! No, yeah, that's- I think every form of media, you're like... you read the books first. Do you think Cheeseburger stands a chance here? Is he gonna get to the end? It's okay. <laughs> My voice cr It's okay! <laughs> um, it's okay if you didn't. I, do, I'm kind of doing this just to kind of fill time to show I'm still alive, and I'm kind of getting viewership from it, so it's, it's really win-win. Because I just didn't want to leave you guys when uh, Super Mystery Dungeon ended. But he's getting those confusions. Well, let's confuse this gloom. Shoutout's pretty fast, too, because it's faster than Pokemon that are, like, four levels higher than it. Or, like, three, I think. No! Well, now I'm not fast.
I think I have a plethora of healing items here. Good, use your... Hurt yourself. Hurt yourself! Okay, well, I don't care if critical hits can't hit you now. My little music note-headed bird is gonna chatter some more. You know, this chat out's kind of growing on me. <laughs> Only when it's super effective against stuff, though. It's not the long neck executor. <laughs> I love that. If it hurts itself, anyway. Yeah, oh. You're sweeping everything, Cheeseburger. No, I'm not. I'm not gone. Yep, I was streaming today, Kaz. Is it Kaz or Kaz? Kaz, Kaz. Oh, you get round? We're not going to be using that crap. We're going to be using Chatter some more. I think round is only good for, like, double and triple that. Yes, we're using the chat hot. We're, we're, like, we're doing a challenge mode inside of a challenge mode using this cheeseburger for this gym. And we're faring pretty well. I think Chatter does. I mean, it's a signature move, so I, I... The reason it's doing that, I think. So look at this guy. I don't even know his name. He has these... He's, like, carrying these giant scissors. He's, like, got a bunch of Pokeballs there. So I've heard this guy is really easy, but... Knowing our luck, we always fail against the easy people and beat the hard people. Hi, David Does Stuff. What's up? Or da David do does stuff colon three. Wow, we're doing like two gym battles in one episode. Ramos. Oh, I think he has like. I think he has Go Goat and and. Gloom. Ma <laughs> oh no, it has acrobatics. Okay, I don't think we're gonna... No, we're gonna press on. We're gonna hope it hurts itself in confusion. And yeah, that's what I thought, because it, it was confusing way too much. It's kind of weird we're just, like, fighting in this little, this little office here. We don't even have, like, a grass backdrop. Ow, 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 ow. No, chat out lives. I know I'm like wasting resources. Okay. Because we know Megazard will just absolutely sweep this place. So we've got to use chat out. Oh no. Oh, cheeseburger. Che cheeseburger avoids it. Get a confusion! Come on, hurt yourself. I'm dead if it hits the takedown. Oh no, <laughs> I'm dead. Or am I? No, I'm not. Chat Hut lives.
Uh, Miste Sudene. It's not that I like you or anything. Okay, we're gonna Hyper Potion one more time. And then we're just gonna chatter it. Yeah, we need a Wigglytuff. I don't know if you can get Wigglytuff in this game. Oh, I got past all its confusions. Ugh! No cheeseburger! Oh, no, you bastard! No! I think we're gonna have to switch out. Hmm. Nothing really resists here. We can, like, whittle it down with our hyper... I hate to be wasting these hyper potions, but... Ah! <laughs> it hasn't hit one of its confusions yet. Oh my god, if it lands a critical hit, we're dead. Okay, so I think we just have to Hyper Potion one more time and then we can just kill it with Chatter. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh lordy. Oh, I don't know if it'll do it. Okay, we're gonna go let the gods decide this. I'm probably not gonna kill it with chatter, but we're gonna let the confusion decide everything. <laughs> if God wants this chat ought to live, he will see me through this with the confusion kill. Or I might kill it with chatter, I don't know. Oh, I got it with chatter. And his last Pokemon is Gloom, I think. Or no, it's Weeping Bell. Okay, this could be a problem because it has poison moves. We definitely need to heal up. Acid. How much does Acid do? Okay, under half. That's good. <laughs> Smiles go for miles, motherfucker! <laughs> oh, that would have been so bittersweet if it killed itself in confusion. Oh, you go ahead and use that. Oh, one-shotted! Critical hit! Shout-out wins! Yes! <laughs> Cheeseburger! Cheeseburger has triumphed! The Plant Badge? What a generic name. Our chatter took us all the way. And we got Grass Knot, which is actually a pretty good move. <laughs> now let's ride our, our the wacky wacky fun slide. Um, yeah, <laughs> that, that was great. We swept with an Amolga, and we swept with a Chadot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bravo. I, I wish I could amend uh -oh! to a to a text form. 
Oh, well, Pyrrhals is maybe good. Maybe Pyrrhals won. Maybe this is a sign he won his uh, Hearthstone contest thing. Uh, oh, yeah, it's slightly easier to raise. I knew that. Oh, there's the creepy bonding man in the corner. Oh, let's bond with him. Ew! Give me your O power. Oh, and the screen has to fade out. It's giving me prize money. I think we could buy some items, too. Should we keep Cheeseburger on the team? Keep Cheeseburger on the squad? I mean, he's our only flying Pokemon. You know what? I think we're top 10 anime fights and top 10 anime betrayals right there. Easily number one spot in both. Oh, this is... I want, like, just 10 of those. Maybe, like, five of those. Let's see here. Uh, do I like this setup? I think we're gonna get... Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's what Chatot did. <laughs> Meet Ramos' team with Chatter. Just one of the things he brags about. No, this isn't the end of the stream. We're going to be going for 45 more minutes. Ish. I want my duty lump. Those who believed in Cheeseburger. He, he appreciates your support. Sure, so now we go around and hunt some items. Yeah, we're keeping Cheeseburger, don't worry. Oh, look what we can give him, too! Oh, I know who I'm putting that on. You know, that would have been useful for the gym if I had known it was there, but... There you go! There were a lot of close calls there. Maybe Cheeseburger will be the Mimikyu of the series. Maybe. Is someone going to make one of those fake accounts and... Have a cheeseburger uh, avatar. Have a Chatot avatar. And his name is going to be Cheeseburger. Look at these like hipsters wearing scarves. Quite frankly, I was only in your house for free items. And you did not provide those. So, screw your house. <laughs> this is, well, wow, a lot of people have espers in this game. Oh, no. That is an awful battle system. Sure. <gasps> oh, who remembers this from my little skits? Oh, wow, he's doing an honor for that. Ooh. Just get a pokey toy. I liked, uh... Uh, I, I gotta say, I like Serena. And this song is called Unwavering Heart. It's like one of my favorite songs from Black and White. Um, heart of gold. So let's hope Cheeseburger doesn't die then. Anyway, I think we're going to a desert now, so I don't think we want Cheeseburger in the front. I think, or wait, maybe we do, because it has Arena Trap Flygons there. Or, or not Flygons, Trap Inch. <laughs> oh, oh, hi! Professor Sycamore told me you can now wield Mega Evolution. That is truly wonderful. With the power, with that power, you can steer the, your future in a better direction. We can't just cover up old filth with new filth. I implore you to consider what we need to do to change the world into a new, beautiful world. Oh, what a nice man. <laughs> do -do 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 
Yeah, someone someone could maybe make that clip. Just put Primal Diagle Steam over <laughs> that sweeping. Okay, so now we can go to the desert. Oh, Black Sludge! That nice man. So, we can actually... Yeah, I've heard that dub theme of uh, the partner's theme. That's like one of my favorite just Pokemon songs in general, just the, the partner's theme. Just his flaming red hair. The Mr. I'm not a bad guy. Oh no, it's Dexio and John Cena. Beautiful name for a beautiful lady. Okay, we have the mountain region now. The chat out roleplay. <laughs> well, new route, new Pokemon. Um so I think the encounters are all the are just the the mounds of dirt. You actually don't get any encounters from running around. Oh my god! <laughs> we got a rare encounter! Wait, wh what did we name it before? Sandile? Ah, Sandile! S Sandile's back! Jam to the slam! Or slam to the jam! Doesn't affect cheeseburger. What were you thinking? Tank it, Chatot. Or, Cheeseburger, sorry. Wow, you're avoiding all these hits. Uh, okay, you have... You have... Black Sludge now, so... Nice and powerful Garchomp gonna be on our team again. But now I can't escape battle, which is annoying. So it's like do or die right here. <laughs> so what can I do without killing it? Alright, sorry, I'm back. All right, uh, do you know what happened? He died, didn't he? No, he swept the whole gym. And he, like, came within 3 HP dying, like, every time, but he persevered and won. Well. <laughs> so now he's, like, a fan favorite. Oh, man. <laughs> Cheeseburger represent. And we just hit a rare spawn on our first encounter in the desert. We got Gibble. 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 How damn time I swept the whole goddamn gym. <laughs> He's going to go over his credentials and explore this guy. I swept Ramos' team. Just with Chatter. I died. We need to, I need to add that line somewhere. <laughs> Cynthia is what everyone wants me to name this. He's a girl Gibble. We could name it Sandile again. We should totally get the... We're going to get that out. Or I, I don't know, because fairy types are kind of... Uh, kind of big in this in this game, because this is when they debuted. Well, let's go get it. Uh, debut of fairy types, indeed. Hmm, quiet. Mm. Mm. Yes, smashing. Indeed. I'm getting all these good pokies. Pokes. Hmm, well, we don't need Lapras right now. We only need it for surfing. It's kind of better if we don't have it on the team. Because I don't want it to die. Yeah. <laughs> Shoutout needs to Rip. brag to the guild. He just has to. 
we're, we're, I'm adding that line in. I don't care where it is. I don't care if it doesn't even match up what's being said on screen, but I, I'm, I'm putting it in there. <laughs> they called me Cheese Burger back in the day. Don't really know what that <laughs> He's means, a girl. But... He's a girl givel. I uh, yes, I did. Any, anyhow, uh, I think this place is infected, infested with like diglets and stuff. Diglet. Diglet, dig, diglet, dig. <laughs> understood you know whenever i think of diglett i just think of the whole foot thing in the very beginning of the first uh, mystery dungeon game oh right yeah i'm like your feet century century diglett this would have also been a good catcher the the trap inch here but garchomp is way better <laughs> chat out i don't will... exactly know why they called me cheeseburger i don't <laughs> even know what a cheeseburger is Oh, there's actually, like, wind resistance while you're in the sandstorm. Trap Inch! I love Trap Inch. Yeah, I, I uh, know a girl, she really likes Trap Inch, too. That's, like, her avatar Pokemon and everything. Oh, wait, can I just not get it or something? This rail while the, it's windy like this? Are you feel? I'm like really it. feeling it! And we ran a Doug Trio. Yeah, I, I would just I would just start shouting that, but I think people that are in this house be like, please make Ari say, in Pyrals say cheeseburger. I sw I swiped whole gym. What? Oh, a shirt. Oh, oh. that that's if we want to get away with. Uh, we just have like a silhouette of chat on, so the copyright police wouldn't get us. <laughs> I don't think so. I don't know. Yeah, 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 wait, no. Here, here's, some, here's a good line. Also, did you know I traveled to the human world and swept a gym? As the humans seem to call it, I was known as Cheeseburger. <laughs> Apparently, with Chatter. I, I discovered Chatter has a 100% confusion rate, too. It is bull. <laughs> so, flying stab move with 100% confusion. <laughs> And it's 100% accurate, too. Oh my god. Chatot was banned in Wonder Trade. Yep. We've created a Pokemon too powerful. A weapon to surpass Metal Gear. Yeah, the the whole chatter thing, people using it to swear, that, that wasn't real. It really was just too powerful. This chatter was just too powerful. Huh. Bird thing with a note for a head. <laughs> I'm really stealing it. And truth be told, I'm actually eating a cheeseburger right now. Oh. I'm. Yeah, I, I can't. I can't do. I'm really. I'm really doing anything because I would be yelling so loud. <laughs> yeah, it, it's kind of a little later. That's the, that's kind of the the people I've got to find for my uh, my dove here too. It's people who aren't afraid to get a little loud sometimes. Because you can really yeah. tell if someone's trying to keep down their voice so they don't uh, disturb roommates or parents or something. That's oh yeah, totally. That's something I gotta make like, clear. There's reservation. Yeah. I'm not afraid of getting loud. I just need to make sure that I take all the necessary precautions in order to, you know. I got a good uh, rhythm going. Xenoblade. <laughs> Everyone's referencing Xenoblade. I've never played Xenoblade, but I at least know the memes. Yeah. Just look up just voice clips from Xenoblade. It's just like, not I'm not really only the really I'm really it, you know. He says that like when he like gets a critical or something. He's like, I'm really feeling it. And then he just says I'm feeling it when he's just doing normal stuff. Oh my god, this wind is so annoying. That was a sick grind there, Michelle. 
Oh, a Clank. sunstone. Did we, did, we, did we switch from Pokemon to Ratchet and Clank? <laughs> or, or Tony Hawk Pro Skater. <laughs> Tony Hawk Pro Blader. That That's worth, like, a thousand points in that game, what I just did there. So I know we face Team Flare here. I think I'll stop when I get to inside the Team Flare place. Uh, I forget where you go. Play the Mystery Dungeon game. What are your team names? Uh, Verdant Fire. I'm not. Gonna, <laughs> I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna indulge that because mine were really bad. So, to the to the point of it saying, yeah, you know, you can't go online with this team name. I'm like, I know. Oh, I forgot these guys used Hound Dowers and Hound Dooms. So I shouldn't have Bubba in front. What's your opinion on the Team Flare music? And to get a, a firm, accurate representation, so I guess I would re-listen to it after you fight this guy. It's like... Hmm. Well, you're just in time for, uh... Just a second. MEGA SHINGA! It's just our thing when we make evolve. It's not that bad. Yeah, I li I liked uh, I kind of like the Aether Foundation one in uh, Sun and Moon. I really like uh, Black or Team Plasmas in in uh, Black and White too as well. Oh, I've never played Sun uh, Sun and Moon. Oh. I like that one. Team Frontier. Dude, I, I, by the way, I also love how Terry is incredibly, like, <laughs> retentive about that game. Yeah, that's the best part. Well, listening, I mean, watching that guy get angry is honestly, like... It's an art. Into a, yeah, it's, it's an art form. <laughs> he gets angry in such a unique way, and his voice tone whenever he says, No! Always makes me kind of, like, giggle on the yeah. inside. Yeah, same here. Oh yeah, isn't this? When was the game? When was the game that they stopped having the kanji for uh, whenever you use flame blast? Uh, burst. That's fire blast. I'm thinking. I of. think it's this one actually. Gee, it's like that was kind of cool. I and I never knew what it meant as a kid, but I thought it looked cool. I think it's right here. Oh yeah, there's your power plant pass. Ap apples and EOS. I am so sorry for you when you had to do the perfect apple mission. <laughs> yeah. When Chat Up doesn't believe you about these shady characters that join your guild. Does, can he, like, not smell? I mean, he's standing right next to Skun Tank. Yeah. And I, I love how, like, loud everyone's like, come on, this sucks. And then, and then Chat Up's like, no! We have to be friends! Be happy even if it hurts! Even even if it hurts. I came to that. I, I think when I'm doing it, I, I get to the point of like tears almost. Like it almost sounds like I'm about to cry. It's hilarious. Uh, if you actually heard the original commentary that was there when um, you see what I do when I record the mystery dungeon games, I kind of do cold reads for the characters. So say if I was reading for Chad, I'd be like, ah, smiles go for miles. Get ready, Pokemon. Just so the voice actors can fit in that kind of timeline I make. When the Nuzly thing happened, um, I, I was doing it. And then I'm like, what? <laughs> like off screen? Because, yeah, I, I should like upload that or something because it's funny. I mean, I mean that, that, that came out of left field, right? Like yeah. no one expected. But yeah, and then when you go back and play it again, you're like, oh, I can just see the signs. Yeah. The signs, the vanishing, what does it mean? Knock, knock, who's there? Oh, it's knock, knock, who you? Knock, knock, you? Oh, knock, 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 who, me too? Oh, uh, what? Okay, you're going to see this really psycho Team Flare guy when you catch up. I was not controlling any of that text. Here we go. My body is ready. But anyway, Mega Shinka! 
Oh, if we have too many Mega Shinkas, I'm going to burn out my throat. And I, I, my head hurts right now. <laughs> What is that text? That's some Undertale level of bowl. Spit. Go, furry! Green, but I don't think that would have fit. No, oh, yeah, you're gonna shudder, all right, at this incoming bone rush. My lightsaber bone. Oh, you think, you think your sucker punch is gonna do something against Mega Lucario? Now, now, what I'm now I'm imagining Mega Lucario being voiced by the same guy who voiced Meta Knight and uh, and Kirby right back at you, who did like the Spanish thing. Oh, Kirby! That that's actually the the Kaiba voice actor guy, Eric Stewart. He didn't do a bad job. I, I liked it. I could see it. He like did, like a Zoro kind of thing. Yeah, I think that's what he's kind of going for. Who think you? Yeah, I don't know. I can't fucking do Spanish. I can't do accents. I'm straight up. I can't. I can do really shitty ones, but I can't do like really good ones. I don't know. Like some people can like pull it off really well. This man wants to rip me off with 300 poke fresh water. It's the most like exp the world. Pokemon has the most expensive like drinks ever. I think it's like a thousand <laughs> bucks for like lemonade. It's, like, yeah. What the hell. Bye bye, everyone. What? Oh, you're going, Gamer Muhammad. Okay, yeah, see you next time if you choose to show up. I'm probably not going to be doing this on Sunday. Maybe Monday, though. Hopefully, be able to actually show up that time because no more work. Ah. <laughs> Dead. Team Flair. They're just so stylish. I'm kind of banking on them having hound hours and hound dooms. So that's why. I, I, yeah, I, I imagine like, what if Team Flare was like a disease? <laughs> you would start off normal, but then like by day two, you had like a little swirl, and they're like, no. Oh god, no! My no. hair's turning oh, red. No. Yeah. Just the glasses grow on your face. Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> Save yourself. Kill me. I, I, I think any sort of thing like that, I think always creeps me out a little bit in any sort of, like if it's played for horror reasons, like any kind of alien or parasite or something. Yeah. Oh yeah, that is, they do it a lot in like Resident Evil games too. Um, I think my thing I saw that was hilarious though, was, uh, <laughs> there was, someone posted like, Okay, you know how in uh, Mario Odyssey you can, like, take over people and stuff, right? Oh, yeah, I know where this is going. Yeah. <laughs> some, some dude's like, yeah, yeah, Martha, it's okay, I'll, I'll see you when you get home. And, and then you hear, like, Jimmy's like, wait, no, no. And he's like, it's a me. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, God. Makes it sound so much more messed up than it actually is. Okay, uh, switching in. That was a big mistake. I do enjoy how Lucario doesn't look like an idiot in this game. He just kind of stands there, just like, yeah. <laughs> Not doing his stupid little it? pose. Is... He holds his paw out like, <sighs> I don't know. He's doing that like weird sort of one one arm more forward than the other. And like one's kind of like at his face. I'm like, what, what are you doing, man? Like, anyway, I also think Reuniclus is pretty cute. That's a pretty cute Pokemon. Yeah, it is. Well, yeah, it is. It's like a little little like germ or I don't know so this if I could hug it but I would get sick I would still hug it <laughs> yeah surprised it's not like one of the the creepy pokedexes for it like it right? contracts a deadly disease whenever you touch it I don't know the second you breathe in its air hey mega shinka yeah, we, oh yeah, Mega Shinka. Mega Shinka yeah. Um, okay, yeah, we're gonna have to switch in Zard here. Who knew a Golbat? If we had a Molga here, maybe this wouldn't be so problematic, but. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm glad Ukario got uh, like skirt wearing lessons from Riku from Kingdom Hearts. Oh yeah, he totally did. The hoops, the hula skirt, or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> uh. what, what's funny is that. Wait, wait, is Solosis the powerhouse of the cell? 
All right, continue. What's weird is that Riku skirt was like put in at like one of the like dramatic parts of the game. It's like I will destroy you. <laughs> and he's wearing a skirt. I'm just like they they <laughs> close around does curtsy. Like. <laughs> uh oh, we. Thing where he like puts his like both both fingers up in a in a, in a like a sideways V, and, you know, like this, you know that kind of shit. Magical girl anime. Riku. Cute dude, it is. Just replace like just replace darkness with like hard power, and congratulations, you've made a magical girl anime. I just hyper potion the wrong Pokemon. <laughs> I I got a little scared right there for a moment. Nintendo Mike shit. please not die. No, he won't die. He's got flawed armor for being the main character. I imagine Mike in the Yamcha pose. <laughs> Yamcha, yeah. Or no, that would be, uh... I was expecting Chadot to be in the Yamcha pose, but he wasn't. <laughs> I'm telling you, dude, like, I think the Yamcha pose is one of the funniest things just ever. Because it's just so sad. It's so sad looking. What's funny too is we never saw that pose until like later because they cut it out of the original dub of it, where yeah, they actually why? showed his body there. Because that's when I saw them use their parachutes. I'm sending you to the next dimension. Yeah. Oh, oh. I I thought Chadot wanted to learn I'm me first. And you're not as Imba as you are in uh, Explorers of Sky. The Whiffer bot. <laughs> yeah. Get rid of... Oh, something's evolving. Oh, we're getting Gavite. I kind of like the, the male line for Gibble because it has the chip in its uh, fin. Yeah. More character in it. More character. It's like a scar. Just thinking of, uh... <laughs> These scars are what made me. <laughs> That's my Gavite. That's what he hears in his head. This is what he actually sounds like. This is actually what he sounds like. He's like, These scars are what made me who I am. <laughs> uh, so, you know, it's, like, it's like myself. I usually hear myself as a decent person, and I listen to myself. I'm like, oh, I kind of sound like an asshole. I think, everyone, for chat I think everyone has that. It's like, oh, I sounded that. just... I sounded just awesome there. And then you just like hear a bunch of mic. <laughs> I'm going to. <laughs> that's that's pretty much accurate. Yeah, <laughs> like the first time I ever recorded anything. <laughs> the worst is singing. Yeah. Because I like singing, and I think myself as a pretty decent singer. I don't know anything about mixing, so like I don't know how that works. Oh. I. I recorded myself singing one time. I actually, like, I think almost smashed my headphones. <laughs> so close to it. Let's like... just delete that file so no one ever blackmails me with it again. Mega Shinka! Sorry about that. Continue. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get shorter and shorter every time. Just beating up some mighty Annas. The next, the next one's gonna be Nani. Nani. Or it has to be like the like the enemy guy, so he has like that really deep. Noni. <laughs> oh. And then the, and then the the Bishonen hero is getting. So. Gonna you. And then he just thinks about his friends, and then he's like invincible. He's just golden after that. No, it's it's, it's like a <laughs> spinner anime. Yeah. yeah, it's the best anime. I I love that video to death. Because it's. Cause it's this highlights all the great tropes. My favorite is the fact that, like, not only do they go, to, like, with a flashback, they go back to it later, just, like, a few seconds later. <laughs> Does those, like, really overdramatic, like, super effects <laughs> with the spinners, like, Beyblade? Yeah. That was the one anime, that's just one anime I can't stand, is Beyblade. They're trying to make spinny tops interesting. Look, okay, the only thing I remember Beyblade for is, like, killing my freaking fingers, okay? <laughs> yes, exactly. Bro, I... My friends were the worst people. They would sharpen their Beyblades. Mega Shinka. Yeah, I know. They... You... What you had to do was buy the bootleg ones. The ones that, like, didn't have any safety on them. 
Those things would like murder <laughs> fingers, and like you would spin it, and it would hit your like, your wrist, and your wrist would start bleeding. Like it was the worst thing. The only other garbage anime is um, uh, Sword Art Online. That's uh, that goddamn Kirito guy. Like what a Mary Sue. Let's have all the girls love him. I mean, like if you're gonna watch a good anime where a character is stuck in a video game, watch Overlord. That's like ten times better. Yeah. Like, it's like, sure, these characters may love the main character, but uh, he's not like a level one. He's like a level 80 with like a billion, you know, points and stuff. And besides, um, they're not even players. They're they're NPCs that came to life. <laughs> he watched two episodes of Beyblades and never watched it again. That is a very yeah, respectable good. person there. Yeah. Sonic Lake. I mean, I, mean, I mean, at least you subjected it to a two episode test. Yeah. I gotta, I gotta, um, I gotta watch, I gotta catch up on. Oh no, sorry, Bright Claw, <laughs> you like both those things. Uh, sorry. Well, I mean, that doesn't mean you can't enjoy it, we just don't enjoy it, yeah? Yeah. But I still hate it. <laughs> I wanna punch Kirito in his perfect little anime face. Animes I've seen are the Pokemon anime, Kirby Right Back at ya. Gotta get that Kirby! You gotta get that dare Kirby. <laughs> what is, that animation was really weird. It was like CG, but sometimes not CG, but Yeah, I, there's actually a pilot that's really good. It doesn't have any dialogue. It's just kind of like it's kind of like a Roadrunner sketch with DDD and Kirby. That's like the that's like the thing unstoppable. He is a harem protagonist, which that's not a bad thing, but if you're gonna like watch something with a harem protagonist, you watch something like Monster Musume, you know? You would watch something else. You wouldn't watch like this anime that's supposed to be taking yourself at least a tiny bit seriously, yeah. Yeah. Do I have Rock Tomb? Cause these uh I have a bad I have a bad feeling I probably shouldn't admit I've watched I've watched Monster Musume. <laughs> I'm not that ashamed. These goal bats are getting that, that, very problematic. Yeah. Impression that everyone's a pervert. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> everyone's a pervert. Yeah, they're, they're, just, they're just good at hiding it. <laughs> Why am I like this? Because... Right. Oh, cool, you do have Rock Tomb. Yeah. There Aram we go. Aram anime... Unstoppable, why? Can I get, like, mod so I can at least time him out for a good while? <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 that deserves a timeout, okay? Uh, I don't know. Right in this. <laughs> we'll, we'll have to we'll review that at the, at the yeah, we'll, at a we'll board meeting. The team. Send it to the team. It's not looking good, Unstoppable. Sorry, man. I can't promise anything. Splatoon the anime starts tomorrow? What? There's a Splatoon anime? Wait, there's a Splatoon anime? The case. I get the hell out of that. And I'm By kind of way. wondering how they made an anime out of it. <laughs> All these people trying to start up these role playings and it's just not working. To a forum, guys. I don't know. You just do. You need, you need a setting, you need characters, you need all that other stuff. Uh, yeah, Lucky Star? I've never seen Lucky Star. Ever. All I know is the Timote meme. That's about it. I kind of felt weird watching Lucky Star because they're, they're supposed to be like, I don't know, 16 or 18, but they look like they're 8. I don't know why I'm just squish squishing this packet of ketchup left and right, back and forth. Hey, <laughs> we need to get you a fidget spinner. Because it makes that sound that, like, oh, I hate that sound. I just hate any, like, bodily fluid noises. I hate people when people swish water and, ugh. You would hate me then, because I am the loudest drinker of any sort of water or any drink. 
just I just drink really loudly. Hi, Troy. It, it's just oh, it just bugs me. And when people chew like, I just can't stand that. That's just them, that's just them being nasty. You know, yeah, nasty. Well, Lucario is just or Furry is sweeping this uh, Team Flare hideout. Once I gave it Rock Tomb. Is he the Mary Sue of this story? Yeah, he is. He's like the Kirito. Like all, like a majority of my Pokemon are girls. Maybe they all love him. He's a perfect swordsman. Even though he's like with the with the bone. His lightsaber bone. For that I'm like, where's like Duel of Fates? <laughs> and, and the sound, you know. So Lucario beat Renamon on the the death Mega Shinka on the death battle. Nani? <clears throat> yeah, he did. <laughs> he's oh my god, he's getting up. Like, like what kind of person makes that noise? <laughs> He's like getting up, holding his holding his shoulder. <laughs> you, made me, you made me only use ten percent of my power. <laughs> Other than personnel, kid. You. Just finish One off. of my favorite videos that you can find on uh, YouTube is. The Fresh Prince of Bel Air anime. It's a 20 second clip and it makes me laugh every time. <laughs> what? It's. Did you ever watch Fresh Prince at all or no? Yeah, I watched Fresh Prince. It was, it was the episode where, like, they got robbed. Oh. Right? <laughs> the entire video is just literally. Um, Will freaking out for a second. He's like, we were robbed. And then uh, Uncle Phil comes in, but he comes in through with, like, instant transmission. <laughs> <laughs> And then he just swells up and dies. That's it. <laughs> I gotta see. I gotta watch that after the fact. Yes, Mega Shinka is rep. Rest in peace, headphone users. I, I realize that. You know what I find unironically funny? Or, what? yeah, it's the, the, the freaking Crash Bandicoot thing. Uh, Whoa! Well. Yeah, that's, I mean... Yeah. Whoa! 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 <laughs> I laugh every time. I, I need to memorize the crash dance, because that, that's great. Uh, I forget what the... the admins use here. Hmm. Got a bad feeling. Got a, like, got a bad feeling about this. I think they just used Leopard, so I should be okay. Let me ask you something. Hmm? The Leopard's favorite piece of clothing. <laughs> what? For loincloth? Hard. <laughs> what? You, you cut out a little bit? Oh, you cut out again. God damn it. A Leotard. A Leotard. Okay. I, I would have... Uh, I would have touched por per loincloth, too, yeah, but... That works. Ooh, that works. Okay, are there any more of these Team Flare goons I have to fight besides the admin? Okay, it's just... Okay, here's the admin. With this bald this guy. Word. Oh god. Oh, Leo Pard with the Tome Brunhilder. Okay. <laughs> Getting some Fates references in here. I actually like this bald dude. Yeah? The Team Flare bald dude here. Oh, he's ready to rough me out. He looks like a bouncer. Like a pimp bouncer. Dude, like, always- the bald people are always the most evil. That's like a fact. 
between having like a really deep voice or they have that like you know that like growly voice like yes come to me little trainer maybe some accent that that's his like backstory too he's just bitter about his receding hairline <laughs> I like how he has a smile on his face <laughs> as he does that little thing, you know? Hmm. He's like, yeah. Also, he only has one hound doom. Is this, is this <laughs> he, like, knocks on his head when he loses. Watch when I beat him. As I do, like, little fist pump. Macaulay Culkin fist pump. No cart 8, uh, they had to censor a, um pose for this uh inkling girl oh my god um so you know that okay cause they've had to sense this before but um you know how in a uh, you, you know how like when we put our arm on our like uh you put your arm on your muscle and then you kind of pull your um arm up and it kind of means like you know like up yours yeah and, but, like, in Japan, it means something completely different. So, like, they had that for the Inkling Girl, and yep. then they, they had to censor that over, overseas. Oh. <laughs> the last thing we need is, like, uh, the Inkling Girl going up yours. Well, I thought it was, like, a sexualized one, because that's usually what they no. they do it with. And yes, I was... Um, one, of my favorite, one of my favorite moments is... Do so you know how, like, whenever something gets censored and we find out about it, we're like, No, uncensor it, yada yada, right? Well, in Bravely Default, um, that happened. There was censorship, right? Oh, but guess what? Um, uh, Mega Shinkan! Anyway, continue. <laughs> no need. All right. Um, uh, in Bravely Default, they had to censor some of the outfits. Yeah. And, of course, everyone cried out about it, right? Um, but the thing is, when we finally learned uh, what they censored and what they changed, we were like, oh, uh, yeah, this is for the best. Oh, what what happened? Characters in the Japanese version are 15, 16, and 18. Or, like, you know, between 15, 16, and 18, right? That age range. Yeah. And they had quite a number of skimpy outfits for some of the jobs. Uh, if you want an, exa an example, go with the, bra uh, I think it's, is it the Bravo Bikini? Yeah, the Bravo bikini, that's one of them. And then also, oh god, someone cosplayed it. Uh, that's one. Um, the Spell Fencer outfit is also kind of another, or whatever, uh, I think, and also the Vampire one might have been another that they had to censor. So in the American version, all they did was cover them up a bit more, like give them more clothing, and they also increased their age from that age range to over a, you know, a legal adults. So like 18 and up. Ah. Uh, that one was, uh... And then, and then everyone was like, yeah, that was for this is for the best. Do you remember what got um removed in Fire Emblem Fates? The Pokemon oh, Army, <laughs> like where you could pet your unit. Oh, and look, these superheroes. I don't totally don't know who they are. Wait, yeah, wait. There was like the wait. They removed that. Yeah. Uh, for like Western releases. Yep. Hi, Jesse. Why? And also, why would that be programmed in the first place? <laughs> yeah, because it, it's creepy and weird, but <laughs> there was an outcry. Hey, you're a soldier. I don't know, man. If if I saw just this weird hand come out of nowhere and start petting me, I'd be like, dude, what the hell? Like, can this thing away from me? This is, this is really stupid right here. When Dexio and Cena are these, like, superheroes or something... And she... Scarves. We just hope we, we don't get, uh... Well, let's just hope it doesn't get tangled in any gears. <laughs> and they even have, like, a new theme song, which is just their normal theme, just sounding more heroic. Hi, TJ3185. You, you came at a really bad time, because we're about to end. Rip. Uh, once I get out yeah, of this place. Don't, don't push yourself too hard. Here, take these. be Pokemon champion without spamming full restores. <laughs> Unheard of. Lance. Look at you with your stupid freaking Dragonites. Hacked Dragonites. I swear to God, they were like, we don't know what other dragon Pokemon to give them here. Let's just give them. Yeah. Aerodactyl. That's totally a dragon. <laughs> Charizard. 
We're just gonna use dragon airs because crap, there's only one dragon. Dragon air isn't at least a water type or something because like they live in the sea or whatever. Yeah. Is it pure dragon or is it is it water dragon? Yeah, it's it's like why Florges for some reason is is mono fairy. Oh yeah, you expect it to be grass. Grass, but no. I think I think when anyone, but I think when anyone is like, or you know, involving them in something, they usually consider them grass type as well. The Pokemon. I, I don't I don't believe that. Like, why would this why would this Pokemon be so heavily grass influenced if it wasn't grass? The flower Pokemon. The Pokemon that was given eternal life. Okay. Is is heavily drawn. Just just whatever you do, don't Google image search it. <laughs> exactly. <Whatever you> do. <laughs> uh I can get nowhere else here. Like it's just back to Lumo. So we're gonna be face facing Clement, I think his name is. Can I tell you how this guy, like, I don't really think he's a relevant character in this entire game. Like, he didn't need to exist. Who? Oh, the the giant guy who yeah. has a random backstory, like, at the final act of the game. Kind of comes out of nowhere, I'm like, all right. Yeah. Okay, so I think I can come through on my promise and we can see some creepy shit now. Amazing. Oh, well, we have to go escort Sean to Prism Tower. I, why am I just thinking of that? Like, Sonic, uh, Sonic, uh, not Sonic, but, uh, Star Fox Adventures. <laughs> Cross oh, the Palace! <laughs> Don't want to the Noto General Scales! Bunker to go to Naughty Dinosaur Planet! I so hate that game. Bad. It's so bad. <laughs> I mean, Star Fox Assault at least attempted to return. Yeah. To that was... I mean, and, and, dude, if you listen back at Assault's soundtrack, oh my god. Space epic. That's all I'm going to say. It is just pure gold. Yeah, I found Assault like, it's like an apology. Oh, we get to see yeah. Lumos Tower light up. In the middle of day. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure everyone loves that sight. Not really. I'm not entranced, Clement. Is that supposed to be like a little lightning bolt on his head? I don't know. Like Zat He's like Zatch Bell. <laughs> yeah. He said the future is now. I'm like... No, the future is far from it. Why are you a girl? Because why not? Yeah. Yeah. Everyone's on, been asking. Let, 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 it, let a man live out his dreams. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Who, who do you think you are? Think you just come in here with that, with, with that, with that, with that, with that words? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to come through on my promise and we're going to see some freaky shit. Uh, this is not the building. Apology, what is Star Fox Zero? Uh, <laughs> he got drunk one day. Yeah. Like, guys, ugh, look, this hangover, let me tell you. We need to make a Star Fox game. Oh, God, not this again. But let's make Fox go in a, a, a chicken robot, and you have to control it with your, with your remote. Uh, you guys remember... Star Fox 2. What, you mean the one for the Super Nintendo? Yeah, this is... Just throw that big. Also, blue tasted McFurry drink to throw out. Also, we're gonna have a really cool, like, anime trailer, but we're not gonna make a show out of it. <laughs> we'll have the funds. That was Cause like... Because that, that, like, acts, that's like the only good thing that came out of Star Fox 0. Yeah, that anime trailer. It's like that, um... The reveal trailer for Palutena, and... How that looks so cool, oh, but it's... <laughs> Not God. a real thing. Well, I, I love how that's, like, the only one that's actually, like, anime. Yeah, well, the the, fi the Fire Emblem one was kind of in the sta style of Awakening. Okay, but anyway, yeah, here comes some freaky shit. 
I think, I think this is the building. I think this is it. Yeah. Here comes a new challenger. No, you're not the one. Back to your reg regular schedule of programming. And that was something completely different. Uh, the first what time the I saw hell? that. Was... Uh, oh. the first time I saw that, I was like, what? <laughs> what was that? Like, you're not the one, and he's here. Because <laughs> I had, like, nine-year-olds singing that, and I know it's a dead meme at this point, but I don't care. <laughs> I'd expect more to hear, oh, Battle Girls. I'd hear, I expect to hear, like, he, And you have that, like, classic, I don't know what that is. It's just, you know, that, like, Oh, yeah, the old Chateau in Gen 4 was way more creepy. I don't even know what this building is for. Uh, I've never looked into the creepy stuff. Yeah, the old chateau is just everything's like really spooky. There was actually a generation short based on it. You should watch that. Like they even managed to make that really just disturbing and creepy. I mean, I, I remember like the whole like when they included the white hand thing in uh, era. I was like, oh shit. <laughs> the Twilight Zone. Dead. Dead. Every single 15 year old who just got his video editing software loves Pokemon and decides to make a theory, quote unquote, <laughs> on how red is dead and Matt's silver. Yeah, it's like we don't already know that. <laughs> That's the reason he's on the mountain, because people are known to, like, die on Mount Fuji or something. My god, I hate this place. It's so hard to find the Pokemon Center. Ah, here it is. Pokemon? I love how specific you wanted us to say poke, uh, poke a mon. Yeah, I was, I, I realized people are, um, weren't, were not going to listen, but I tried my best because I just, it, it's weird just when you're in the same conversation, you know, and one person says Pokemon and the other person says Pokemon. Just wanted everyone saying the same thing. So me. This is good for me because I can just be like. Because the character already sounds... It sounds more natural to say Pokemon instead of just like... Miss you or less Andre. Pokemon. Oh yeah, there's a Gary Oak reference here. Uh, the famous Professor Oak's grandson came here to the Kalos region to study abroad. Or bored. He, he got bonjour down just fine, but he still always said smell you later when he left. Bam, 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 <laughs> Smell you later, ashy boy. Oh my God, I barely remember Gary in the anime. I'm sorry. But I think that's where we'll end off. Did a good uh, two hours and sixteen minutes, not including our amazing startup time. Yeah. Good having you again. Of course, it is always a pleasure. Yep, pleasure having you too. Uh, if there's any last questions, we can uh, oblige you. Otherwise, we're going to end the stream. I'll just let them get that. Let the questions roll on in. We're going to be going against Clement in his stupid Cinnabur Island wannabe gym. And there are plenty more mega shinkas to have later, and more nannies and. <laughs> so. I I think Goku did that the most. <laughs> yeah, Gary motherfucking Oak gets twelve badges and Kalos when you have only eight. 
Gary motherfucking oak. Man, I don't... Was that ever answered why he had ten badges in that one scene? I think it might have just been an animation flub. Yeah. Yeah, we, we kind of stayed on topic in this one, but we, we got the cheeseburger sweep, we got the emolga sweep, and we got a gibble. How's your date? Well, I've been kind of sick, so... It's been kind of crappy, and I've been screaming Mega Shinka, and that hasn't helped it. Next stream is probably going to be on Monday. Wait, who is Mar Marilyn and Pro Victini have voice MP3? Mm. Well, I don't know. That well, I know Marilyn's a guy who makes Pokemon videos, and Pro Victini's a guy who makes Pokemon videos. I don't know what voice MP3 will is. You make, will you make sure that Shadot brags about his victories in <laughs> the Ramos Gym and EOS dubbed? Well, I don't know how we'll do that because there's not a, a point where in the story maybe uh, an extra scene, those extra skits will come up. Like a tiny, maybe like a tiny little thing, <laughs> yeah. you know? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Uh, make shout out brag an ending scene like in S uh, Super Mystery uh, Super Mystery Dungeon. <laughs> yeah, we won't save it for anything like like character defining. We'll just save it for chat out bragging about it. Yeah, I know, like. <laughs> It has to be like when the story is already getting intense. Right? Yeah, like it's just starting to get. Intense. Forget about re then, it, forget about reconciling with Nuzleaf. No, no, just, just scrap that kind of stuff and put in chat up bragging about beating a Gloom, a Go Goat, and a and Jumpluff. So the stream was Emolga, Emolga fan fiction chat out sweet mega Shinka memes. Yeah, yeah. I mean pretty... that's, that's that's a pretty productive stream, if you ask me. <laughs> oh, how did you do in your uh, tournament, by the way? Oh, I swept that. Oh, well then maybe that's a sign. Maybe that's it why was, he was, did. It was unbelievable. Just like those games, I think lasted maybe like twenty minutes. Your your destinies are like intertwined, maybe. That's something that that crappy Shout champion would say. Actually, my yeah, our destinies are intertwined. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't do this for you. I did it for the damn fourth chaos emerald. <laughs> I will never get over the fact that in generations, when you beat him and you have two of the chaos emeralds, he gives you the fourth one. Yeah, that's like you bastards. They knew. They knew. Uh, it was quote unquote made for Western audiences. Chad up pops his head into the hero and partners room and is like, by the way, did you know I once defeated a gym leader? <laughs> he freaks out. It's like, what? You know the human world? And I'm like, and I'm like, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I remembered it was Jump Fluff. Oh no, it was Jump Fluff, Weef and Bell, Go Go. Yeah, it's Jump Fluff, Weefenbell, and Go Go, right? Yeah. Anyway, I think oh, we'll stop. AFK. I think we'll stop the stream here. Okay. So thank you for coming, guys. All I think it got up to like twenty-eight or something at one point. Um, Ooh, we're getting there. Yeah, I'll probably be doing this again on Monday about the same time. So I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.